What's up guys, welcome to what is a brand new football game. Before you get ahead of yourself, it is currently in open beta, so not quite sure what to expect. There may be some bugs and glitches along the way, but hopefully it's a decent game. Now, I've literally just clicked straight onto the game and this is the first thing that's come up. So I think we're going to call this club Evolving United. Because why not? <laughs> Or is that going to get a bit confusing? Considering we have another series called Evolving United. What about Red Devils? Does that work? Oh, it does. There you go. So we're going to be called Red Devils and our abbreviation is going to be called Red. Continue. Next up, you have to choose a captain. Your captain will have the highest attribute scores of your starting squad. Well, I mean, we're obviously going to take Ronaldo, right? I mean, some of the graphics are... Some of them look really good. I mean, KDB there, I'm not 100% sure on. Ah, we got some attributes. Hello. What am I seeing here? So, Ronaldo is 91 rated, 91 pace, 91 shooting, 85 dribbling, 87 fitness. Five star is that five five on both so he can he's two footed basically. Portuguese hundred energy, no skin. Okay, we've got Ronaldo, uh, and then we've got to pick a formation. So, is there only three formations in the game? Genuinely not sure. Your formation will influence your starting lineup and basic tactics. A five three two. Defenders operating like win backs to support attacks. Less attacking potential, but solid in defense. 4 4 2. Pack in the midfield means the playstyle can change in a flash. Balance and versatility. A 4 3 3. Focus on attack minded possession. When you lose possession, press hard to get it back. Strong attacks with intricate short passes. It's either the 4 4 2 or the 4 3 3 for me. Probably going to go for the 4 3 3. So. Is this our squad? Are we getting our team? Ronaldo up top. Oh my god, it's terrible. <laughs> it's terrible. I'm now ready to play online matches, manage your club, and improve your squad with new players. <laughs> Alright, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I've just gone through a load of stuff and didn't realise there was copyrighted music on. Rookie mistake. Absolute rookie mistake. However... What I would say is this game, I've not played no games yet, so don't worry about that. This game has serious potential so far. I'll show you now what I'm talking about. So if we head into here, this is our squad. I've just gone out and made some sign-ins. Now, how do we... Ah, so do you have to remove someone from the club? Select from... Ah, there we go. So I've gone out and I've signed a new goalkeeper. Uh, I've signed myself... Uh, I can actually sell him as well. Look, 730. Uh, oh, hello. No, I'm going to do that. We want to select from the club. Got myself a new left back. And I'm going to show you how this is all done in a second. We are going to sell this guy because I've already got a backup cam. Who's better. So let's sell him. Select from reserves. And we'll take another centre back. We have already got a 70 rated. This guy's got more pace. Same defending. One less physical. Not as good on the ball. Or in fact. Yeah, no, he's not as good on the ball. But it's nice to have a backup centre back. You never know. Especially with the way I get red cards in FC. We want Delmas to go in. In he pops. And this is basically the team we've got so far before we jump into any games and i've just seen something game plan oh would you look at this so we'll have a balanced game plan attacking defensive form ah oh, there's other formations fantastic i was a bit worried that you had to choose just that one formation but we've got other ones as well now honestly I haven't got a DM, have I? That sucks. I'd go for a 4-2-3-1 wide because that's how I like to play football. 
Um, I find it a really balanced formation. What's that? Sixty-five defense. Uh, I mean, we could go and technically buy a DM or two if we wanted to, but I think we're going to leave it like that for now. Uh, and game plan, tactics, defensive style. Oh, look at this! It's literally like FIFA, guys. Duties. Oh, look. Play narrow. Play wide. For the fullbacks, support the attack, zonal marking or man marking, pass interception, situation base, hold position, justified risk. That's mental, man. That's this is so insane. It feels like in terms of between this and FIFA or FC, whatever you want to call it, um, there's a few more options. Left corner will have the left back. At the right corner, I guess we'll take the right back. Long free kick. Callahan, maybe? I guess we'll put Ronaldo on the free kicks, actually. And on the penalties. Cool. Ah, this is quite cool. Um, yes, it's similar to FIFA in the sense of the tactics. However, I feel like it's a lot more in-depth. I really do. There's some really nice options. And you can set up different tactics as well. Look, different formations. Again, like FIFA. Defensive attacking balance. I mean, if you're being critical, it's only in beta, but maybe a couple more options, a bit like FC does. But honestly, for me personally, freeze more than enough. Auto recover. Yeah, do auto recover. Uh, no, cancel. Auto recover is fine. So we've got a 65 right back in the reserves. So basically, what you guys wouldn't have seen that I was talking about is if you go to transfer market... In the top right hand corner you'll see something that says cp their credits so that's essentially if you was playing fc that's like your coin balance in the beta we had a million to start off with and obviously we sold that guy for 300k on the game when it's released i don't know if that will still be the case or not i'm not quite sure uh next to that you'll see something that says lp and i think they were called league points and I think they were for the season pass, if I remember rightly. And then you have one that is RP. I'm not sure what it stands for yet. I'm trying to work this out as well. Um, and you can come to the transfer market. You can put in who you want. So, for example, if I wanted to buy... If I wanted to buy Bruno Fernandes, he's either 108.6 million credits or 120,000 RP. I don't know how many credits and stuff you get per game. But I will show you something else. In fact, I've just seen one other thing. You can loan players as well. That's fantastic. You can buy loans. That's really, really nice. What I personally did, where I got them players from, I left that on any. And because I had a million in the club, I just put in CP max value 1 mil. However... They were all free agents. Every player I signed is a free agent. So as an example, because we're now playing something with a cam, if I want to sign this guy, you just literally click on him and then add to club. And because he's a free agent, he just goes into your club. Or is the game frozen on me? Game might have frozen. All right, we're back. We're back. We're good. Um, so if I head back over to market and... If I go to value free agents only, it feels a bit like if FIFA was add to club. There we go. Now in the squad, all sorted. Um, if FIFA was, if you had ultimate team and career mode together, basically. See, I just saw we've got three more spaces left in the club. This Donnarumma guy, we're going to sell for five hundred ninety k. That's fine. And then we're going to select from reserves. And we're going to add in our new center attacking mid. Who, of course, because he's better, will play over the other one. So there we go. We're already making upgrades to the team. Actually, and on that point, I don't know if you would have seen this already. On this little dial option, the one that says skills is highlighted in red. If we click on that. 
basically you can start adding certain things into your player now you'll see there's xp in the top left hand corner so he's level zero and he's zero out of 7500 xp i don't know how this is going to work but i'm assuming you level up you'll get a skill point and you can unlock each individual one so for example agility here adds five to players agility uh, point or second wind at 75 minutes player stamina recovers by 50 percent. that could be quite legit yeah th this is super nice man this is a bit more like pro evo or e-football whatever you want to call it um in that respect but that's super nice feels a bit like evos mixed with the way e-football does their upgrades kind of cool um and then next up is if we go down to events you've got challenges and win several matches in a row is 20 million credits so if you win three games in a row you'll get 20 million credits i don't know what star points are i can't quite work that out um watch your legs exclude several tackles so execute 10 tackles you get 20 million credits play score repeat you get 500 league points we'll come on to them in a minute second half master score several goals in the second half 20 million credit and i know it sounds like a lot right 20 million credits you got to think like real life transfers or real life career mode where players are it's not like you go on up the team you buy someone for a few hundred coins <laughs> so they're the daily challenges and then down below you've got the weekly ones as well which is kind of cool again i expect they'll probably change within um when the full game's released i don't know that there'll be that much who knows uh the next thing is team pass now i have already bought this we've bought the um premium one there's a standard and a premium and if you look in the top right hand corner of the screen you'll see what says sp is it sp or lp um essentially that's what uses that's what you buy the premium passes with and i didn't know this but it's mainly cosmetic stuff so there's kits there's balls um oh, i'm actually learning more on the go here so we've unlocked the first three pages and we can buy anything we want from this so we can buy an rp booster for 10 matches for 10 of them sp points see i'm learning on go here guys that's interesting and then look to unlock this page keep completing challenges to earn star point okay so that's what that star points was we saw them didn't we interesting so that's quite cool that's a different dynamic essentially the more you play the game the more things you can unlock so for here i can unlock some league points back which is what I used to purchase this in the first place. And in fact, the other thing I can do is unlock a CP booster for 10 matches. So we're going to boost our match coins for 10 matches. In fact, I'm probably going to boost the XP up as well. There's a lot to try and get my head around with this game. Um, there is something called divisions. I'm not quite sure how this works other than play one match to reach the next qualification step and get a reward i think we're going to just have to play a match there is ranked which is basically just online play or there's local which is offline but you need two players you need two controllers um and what we're going to do is we're going to go in and search for an opponent i have no idea how this game plays um no idea how we're going to get on but let's just see it's football at the end of the day uh yeah except i like that you see everyone's gonna have the same kit yeah we'll go for the white this one so this is his team he chose De Bruyne. we chose ronaldo see he's gone in basically with that base team that you start the beta off with his squad costs 138 mil so does that mean he could actually sell De Bruyne? i think he can all right some nice graphics there on the screen i'm i'm curious i'm really curious to see how this feels we're underway 
So that is a little bit similar to FIFA in the sense of a little bit of uh, close control ball movement. Or oh, lost the ball there. That's not good. Watch out. Don't know how I feel about this camera angle, but it will do for now. Callahan. Oh, lost the ball. And again. Yeah, nice jockey. Love that. Terrible ball. Absolutely shocking. Gotta remember we haven't got any DMs at the minute either, have we? So I don't know how these two centre mids are gonna get on. Hopefully they do a job. Free ball for Ronaldo. Ah, oh, not good. Go on. Ronaldo hits it. Oh, what a banging finish. Cristiano Ronaldo. Love that. Fantastic. 1-0. Let's go. What a finesse shot. Bear in mind, people have got, like, really bad teams. So, oh, that's a great block. Uh, oh, there's going to be mistakes either side. That's a great tackle. Genuinely, so far, this game feels a little bit more like, I would say, probably Pro Evo than FC. Um, I wouldn't say it feels exactly the same, but it's more along the lines of Pro Evo. So if you like that sort of gameplay, I'd say this will probably be right up your street. Um, in fact, in all fairness to this game so far ufl feels a little bit more responsive in some respects than pro evo um sometimes pro evo can feel a little bit too clunky on the gameplay i'd say there's probably quite a nice balance here i know this game will get its haters as well but so far and again we're 25 minutes into a game but so far, I'm enjoying my experience. There's potential. Nice. Good, good interception. Callahan looking for the one two. Oh, they read that well there, to be fair. Oh, weird save, but it'll do. Saved it again. Don't. Oh, my God. Like, keeper's a little bit suspect, maybe. Keep up. Catch it. Okay. Or not. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of suspect maybe at times from the keeper. He is low rated, so I don't know if that factors in. Over the top. Love that. Oh, I couldn't win the ball. Watch it. Watch it on the counter. Nice. Oh, I couldn't get the ball away. Unlucky. We're one half into our debut on UFL. And I'm enjoying it so far. It's refreshing. 51% possession to 49. We've had, he's had a couple more shots to me, but we scored that absolute weldy with Cristiano. Um, yeah, it's, it's quite fun so far. I'm enjoying my experience. Let's just resume and see how we get on. Oh, weird save, but good save nonetheless. He, he, I mean, he's got it out of danger, to be fair to him. Oh, you can manually pull your keeper out as well. Love that. Yeah, and that's why he shouldn't do it. He didn't even jump for the ball. 1-1. One, one. Fair enough. Mistake there from me. Nice, good control. Over the top. Can we get there? Oh, no, no, we can't. Nice, well played. 
Oh, not good ball there. Oh, he's hit the post. Watch it. Pressure's coming on now. Oh, what a finesse shot. Fair play. I can't even complain about that. Good goal. Pressure's been coming. Nice. Spend him. Get it out. Come on, the attack's on. The attack's on. Oh, looking for Ronaldo. Couldn't quite find him. Go on, press them. Well done, Ronaldo. Love that. Beautiful. Out wide. Ronaldo puts the ball in the box. Looking for Callahan, actually. Callahan? No. No, 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 no. We're knackered. We're absolutely knackered. We're trying to run back. Oh, shoots high and wide from them there. Oh, dear. Oh, I've made it. I've made that critical mistake I always make. He's put it wide of the goal. He's put it wide of the goal. Would you look at that? Come on. Can we get one more chance? The ball out wide. Nice. Really nice there. Good control. Shoot! Oh, it's in the back of the net. Let's go. Love that. One, uh, two, two. Come on. Nice. Go on, then. Hit one. Oh, straight to the keeper. Probably should have crossed that there, to be fair. Nice. Oh, unlucky. Watch it. Don't concede late on. Don't concede late on. He's moving the ball around nicely. We defend it well. Oh, we've given it straight back up. Don't. Nice. Get it out. We draw our first game 2-2. Two, two. Honestly, that was actually really enjoyable. We've got the goals. So, first up, Ronaldo. Nice passing move from us. Ronaldo with the finesse shot. That's insane, man. Love that. Beautiful from Ronaldo. Did go through his foot a little bit, but we'll take it. Uh, and then the second goal was Callahan. We actually went 2-0 up, didn't we? No, he got a goal back. He's got Callahan as well. Of course he has. Yeah, poor from me. I moved the keeper out expecting him to just claim the ball. Um, and he didn't. So maybe that's a lesson learned. And then he went 2-1 up in the 63rd minute. Guy was a good player, actually. That's a filthy... Sorry, what? That's a filthy goal. He sort of chipped it slash finesse shot it into that far corner. Dirty. Keeper's got no chance with that. Nice finish. And then in the 85th minute, our brand new signing, actually, hits one into the bottom left-hand corner. Lovely goal. 2-2. Two, two. We'll take a draw. So we get, because we got the credits and stuff, the boost, we've got 19 million credits for that. We're also starting to show that we're getting some skill points and stuff done. You'll see them all going through the screen. Qualification A done. Qualification B. So we got a base reward of 8 million credits. Two goals. 12 tackles, possession, passing accuracy, two goals conceded, you lose, three kicks, you lose, credits rating, CP booster, and then reputation points, zero. 
we lose some fitness so i'll be interested to see how this works but how do we get it so that they um basically regain fitness so divisions 20 million credits so we're up to 40 mil which is super nice qualification b complete all two qualification stages to be promoted to a ranked league okay so these are these are like um i can't remember what they used to be called on fc or fifa but you had to play like qualification games essentially to see what division you were going to be put into was it placement games was it placement i think it was uh into events challenges play score repeat we get 500 league points which is super nice play several consecutive matches without receiving a card one of five no way am i doing that although to be fair i didn't really slide tackle too much in that game so if we head over to the transfer list and if i say that i've got maximum value of 40 million cp it's gonna get me nothing i'm kind of surprised so 40 mil is getting me literally zero. Eze 79, Araujo 72, Jota, James, Isaac, Rodrigo, Pedro Neto, Bay 70 mil, Allison 37 mil. Why is he not coming up then? A bit weird. All right, so maybe we'll do it from this side. Conor Gallas Connor Gallagher is down as a DM. That's super nice. Gavi Garnacho. Got Garnacho as a cam. Damn. Hoyland. 75 mil. Oh my. Onana. Is that Everton's Onana? I'm assuming is who they're talking about there. Andreas Pereira. Anthony Alanga. I'm looking for Man United past and present here. Solanke, Shakiri, Bayo. Do you remember him, Remy Cabello? Right, Nori, the uh, Wolves left back, who we are linked with. Diego Delo, 54 mil. Kilman, Sassy, Gundawan, McTominay, 48 mil. Quite generous on the stats to McDominay, to be fair. Uh, who else have we got? Anthony, 42 mil as a cam again. Kind of mad. 78 pace, you've done him dirty there. 75 shooting, 75 passing, 82 dribbling. Wow. Rudiger, Suchek, Onana, goalkeeper, 24 mil. That's super tempting. Diving handling's not great. Kicking and reflexes are good. Positioning's good. Speed's low. But that's a. Uh, can we, in fact, add to bookmark? There we go. Daily Blind, X Man United, seventy pace. Jeez, Casemiro. Casemiro is slower than Blind. Apparently, that's interesting. Eighty-three defending on Casemiro as his base stat, as his uh, standout stat. Now, I believe these guys can level up. So, uh, let's put him in as well. I'm looking for Mainu. Isn't that? Can we search by name? Oh, we can. Oh, look at this. Look at this. There's me being an absolute amateur. Mainu. Kobe Mainu, 16 mil. Only 78 rated. 84 dribbling, though. Oh, that's super tempting. Uh, again, let's add him to bookmarks. Who else do I want to look at? Uh, what about Martinez? There's so many Martinez. Uh, we want Lissandro, don't we? 74 rated. You're doing my man dirty. What is that? Uh, let's add him to the bookmarks. Might be able to buy a few Man United players here. Which I'd be super down for. Uh, Luke Shaw. I bet he's going to be butchered, right? Luke Shaw, 78 rated. Luke. I mean, I'd be happy to go through with some of these with you guys on stream as well. Um, Wambasaka. 
79, 21 mil, 12 mil, 76 overall. Damn, add him in. So for now, we'll leave that there. But if we go over to bookmarks, that you can see I've added in Onana, Casemiro, Wambasaka, Mainu, Shaw, Amrabat, Martinez. And in fact, what we could do is when this game fully releases, essentially a bit like what we're doing on FC, but it's going to be a bit more of a grind, I think. Start working towards the full Man United team and then trying to level them up as you go. It's not like FC where they get a new card every week. So I think what we're going to do for now is I have to buy Kobe Minu. I just have to. Um, he can play DM as well, which is exactly what we need. New spot. I don't want a new spot, do I? Now in your squad. Right, so in he goes. Um, in fact, I'm really tempted to get Amrabat and Martinez as well. I can't believe how disrespectful that is to Martinez, by the way. Genuinely. Uh, so let's buy a player. Now in your squad. Do I get Amrabat as well? I guess we do, right? 12 million. Right, so we've just gone and bought a few Man United players. Oh, see, look, he's got a skill. He's actually got a skill available. And I can... Oh, this is so sick. I can add five ball control. I can add composure, stamina, jumping, pass accuracy, awareness, strength, shot power, long shots, tackles, interceptions. Oh, this is so cool, man. You can start unlocking alternative positions through skill points. You can... Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. I love this. I genuinely love this. Uh, so let's add for him. I mean, he's going to drop to the bench. But let's add... Can I see what his composure and stuff is now? Ah, oh, look, there we go. That's what we want. So his composure is currently 67. Let's add five composure. Look, central defensive midfielder. Ten more interceptions and he can... Oh, that's incredible. So, composure. Add five. Boom. I love that. I love this. And then you'll see there, look, composure's got a little green mark next to it. And it says plus five. I love it. I am so here for that. So, we've made some progress. We've got three United boys in. And obviously four including Ronaldo, but three more is what I mean. Um, so that's interesting. If you look at Ronaldo in that right-hand corner, I'll try and highlight everything I can in the edits for you guys. In that right-hand corner, you'll see that he's got 6,310 XP, but he needs 85,000 to level up. And I believe that's because he's a 91 rated. Where if I scroll down to this guy, he needs 7,500 because he's 67 rated. I love that. Look, yeah, that's great. Amrabat needs 28,000 because he's 76 rated. Minor needs 34. I love that, guys. I think that's absolutely brilliant. I really, really do. Uh, let's add the right back on the bench as well, I guess. And I think we're just going to jump into another one. I think there's so much potential with this game. I really do. Let's jump into another ranked match. A few moments later. All right. So at the minute, I'm 45 seconds in searching for a, a ranked match. Maybe this could be the only issue. I know it's a beta. So again, I'm not overly worried, but we're nearly a minute in now and haven't found a game. So let's cancel that. and Let's try again. I mean, last time I found the game within a few seconds, but... Is it because we've leveled up on the division side of things? Right, guys, this is a bit of a concern now. Um, we're unable to find anyone. What I think it is, is purely because the beta's only just come out. Um, we've already played that first game. So we're trying to find new people and not enough people have started playing the game to then get to that next level. 
as time would go on i would suspect this would become easier but we'll give this one last try out. otherwise we may have to end the video here if i'm honest it's looking likely that we're not going to find anyone so what i'm going to quickly do if someone comes in now then great but if not i'm just going to give you my brief thought i think this game has got a lot of potential genuinely a lot of potential um if you guys haven't downloaded the beta it's available this weekend and it can be played on xbox or playstation it is new gen only i believe but if you're a bit fed up of fifa or if you know what if you just want to try a different game it's a free open beta you can download it honestly check it out guys we're not going to find no one we're another minute in um check it out like for me the gameplay was genuinely a cross between fc24 and pez or eFootball, and that's not necessarily a bad thing like it was a little bit more on the clunkier side than fc so if you're expecting fluid movement all the time and fluid dribbling maybe it's not for you it's in beta so yes you might get a few bugs there might not be that many people always on the game um but just give it a try just see what you think ufl have actually said there is some problems with the servers again it's a beta it's there's no no drama um i think there's so much potential in the menu side of things and in the uh, in the upgrade systems and the transfer market etc and i love the fact that my news xp is different to someone else's like Callahan, for example ronaldo's is a lot higher I love the fact that you can then go into use your players in game the more you use them the more you can like get these skill points so look amrabat can play center back if when i get a skill point i can unlock him to play center back and he could slot in alongside martinez Mainu, again same thing could go into center back you can boost the stats up give them alternative positions there's so many things you can do and again with these skills you unlock more as you play through the game so this one here is locked distributor one is required so if you unlock that you then get a second level that you can unlock i just think there's so much potential with this and i believe don't quote me on this but i'm pretty certain when it's released as a full game it's free to play i'm sure that was one of their selling points so yes you're going to see some bugs and stuff on this game over this weekend no doubt just give it a try for yourself is all i'm basically trying to say but for now guys that is going to be the end of this video thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it i don't actually know how long this video is going to be we'll be back again tomorrow with evolving united or potentially some more coverage on this depends how this video goes down to be honest but for now that is the end of it thank you so much for watching Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you all very soon indeed.